Okay, so I've always wanted to make a video teaching people the right way to eat filipinos. Because I feel like it's important. It's one of my favorite things here in the Philippines. So what you gotta do is you have to find a place that looks reputable. This might not look re reputable for most people, but I saw a lot of people eating some balut here earlier, and as long as they're warm, you're safe. So we have choices. Balut or Pinoy. Now Pinoy is an unfertilized duck egg, where the balut has a little dude inside. It's fertilized typically 16 or 18 days. Tagalog here in Manila, I'm used to Misaya. So my favorite is 18 days. 16 days, the little dude inside's a little smaller, about the size of a jelly bean. But we're gonna show you what an 18 day looks like, because that's my favorite. Also an important thing in this whole process is salt and spicy vinegar. So here's the salt. And this would be the spicy vinegar. First step is trying to figure out what direction the egg is, is positioned in. So I'm gonna guess here. I was right. Crack it open, and there'll be some soup inside. A wonderful broth. So we do a little shot of the broth. Mm. Tastes a little bit like chicken noodle soup. Next we're gonna add a little salt, a little bit of spicy vinegar. Let that coat the egg while we peel the shell off. All right, now here's the part I want you all to see. Inside, the white part is actually turned hard. And inside the egg, There's a duck. See the duck? Now typically you would not pull it apart and stare at it, but for educational purposes. Sprinkle some salt, put a little spicy vinegar. Oops. Down the hatch. Mm. Now there's no bones. The yolk is nice and rich. You get the uh, somewhat of like a poultry taste, excuse me, inside. Surprisingly, the hardest part is actually the white, which is the softest part in just a normal boiled egg. The white becomes almost a little bit like an eraser. Not my favorite part, the duck is. Anyway, that's how you would see and eat a balloon here in the Philippines.